star-spangled banner and wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the rest. Corps of Engineers officials, community leaders, and citizens celebrated the 50th anniversary of J. Percy Priest Dam and Reservoir June 29, 2018. With the dam as the backdrop, speeches celebrated the project's purposes and its great impact and importance to the entire region. Nashville Mayor David Briley noted that nearly two million citizens continue to enjoy the many benefits the lake provides those which his own grandfather, Beverly Briley, championed as the first mayor of Metro Nashville when the Corps of Engineers constructed the dam in the 1960s. So it's a privilege and an honor for me uh, every day to be mayor, but especially today um, uh, to commemorate something my grandfather did 50 years ago. Uh, the 19,000 acres of land and 14,000 acres of water continue to be a critical part of our community, a cr critical part of the economic and quality of life here in Middle Tennessee. We also get hydroelectric power from here, which is an important thing for us all to remember as we, as we go about our daily lives. President Lyndon B. Johnson dedicated the project June 29, 1968, as a perfect example of the new conservation. Major Justin Toole, National District Deputy Commander, said President Johnson's vision of reducing flooding, providing water, creating hydropower, and recreation has come to fruition over the past 50 years. Some of us were here 50 years ago, some of us were. Some of us will be here 50 years from now, some of us won't. But you can rest assured that dam will be there. It'll still be generating power. There'll still be family members out here coming out to recreate, to fish. Um, you know, there'll still be Corps of Engineers operating it on a daily basis. The biographer of the project's namesake, the late Congressman James Percy Priest, spoke about how the lakes and waterways would have appealed to Priest's love of nature, to his free and adventurous spirit. Mr. Priest never stopped working for the improvement of the waterways of Tennessee and its region. He was a strong supporter of the Tennessee Valley Authority in developing dams and reservoirs along the Cumberland River. But his most fervent desire was that the river be made navigable, that reservoirs would be built for stormwater protection, and that the powerful forces coursing through the waters would be harnessed into affordable electricity. He would have been very happy when the Corps eventually built not only the Priest Project, but also five more dams along the Cumberland River. The family of Colonel Jesse Fishback, district engineer when the Corps completed construction of the dam 50 years ago, led everyone in the Pledge of Allegiance. Harriet Priest, daughter of J. Percy Priest, unveiled a plaque commemorating the 50th anniversary celebration of the dam and reservoir. This is Lee Roberts reporting for the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers Nashville District at J. Percy Priest Dam in Nashville, Tennessee.